this is round two. Is this round two? Yeah, it's round two. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, let's then let's Wait, just. Wait, that was fast. Let's just uh, look at this game anyway. Uh, Black versus Henshin. Yeah, yeah, round two. Wait, let me let me let me look at the uh, matches. Okay, so far. So Black and Henshin, I think they both have one win already. Yeah. Let's so, look at it. Uh, Henshin, Henshin, where are you? Yep. Hey, no, can't find him. So far, half the people has won, half the people have lost. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Wow, I did not know that. Wow. Predicted. Predicted. Wow. Wow, such a prediction, man. Wait, you could be wrong. How about draws? Uh, okay, there's no draw. This is finished round. All right. You are correct. You are very observant, JS. What a, what a wonderful, astute observation you've made. We wouldn't have known. I would have not known, man. Wow. <laughs> okay, so yeah. So how's the game going? The red green versus a uh, red, red black. black. By the heroes, yeah. looks like uh, Han Jin has uh, has an edge. Although he's running to TP. Yeah, which but I think looking at Lich, Debbie, and uh, uh, Sniper seems to be pretty solid black. But, yeah, but Kifi, the, the bad thing of Kifi is when you draw like six copies of the fighting instinct. Yeah, uh, that sucks. You, you want you want <laughs> to kill sucks. you want to kill yourself. Oh wow, hip fire. Okay, okay. So and no, I think card value wise, uh, Han Xian, Qian, Qian Xin probably has the edge here. Qian Xin. Because you have uh the hourglass. Hourglass. Uh, it's time of triumph. Three assassinate. Three chain frost. A Theosis blade. Spring the trap. Wow. Uh, that is, that is uh. That is very hopeful. That is very ambitious. <laughs> yeah, very hopeful. Yeah. Wow. He, he does have Iron Fog and Payday, but that's that's about. But it. it's only one of each. One so of each. It's not gonna help much. Yeah, and his lineup uh doesn't kill hero that fast. Yeah. So okay. so I I don't understand. Yeah, I don't I don't really agree with such an expensive card in your item deck. Is this gonna clog your deck? Yeah, I think his. How's black stack? Black stack. Golden ticket. I think people just love golden ticket, <laughs> don't they? Yeah, <laughs> I, I have no love for that card. Uh, it's just too RNG, man. The win condition oh, for black. Have, he does have three thunder heights, though. Yeah, the win condition of black stack is the thunder height. Triple thunder, thunder height, yeah. Triple thunder, thunder height. And, and he, yeah, and primal roar to help. One ogre is there. And turn one miss of awareness, I would say. He also has <laughs> enough magic. To, yeah, gar to, to guarantee attacks. Yeah, and, and turn one miss as well. well. Turn one miss. Hey, no, not really. Yeah, so. Altar of the Mad Moon, okay. Yeah, I think overall, uh, Henshin's deck is better, I think. And red, red Black is better in draft generally. Yeah, generally, Red Black's are be red Black is better. And even better in a uh, close tournament because you can uh, look at your opponent's deck. So, yeah. It's very easy for you to play around uh, board players. So. Tyler said sensor drops on the left lane. Yeah. So. Can't yes. clear that. That, that. The Tyler said sensor will, will be a very uh, impactful card from now yes. towards later. Because it's, it's on the left lane. Uh, not too much on the left lane, but it's just shut down uh, the uh, win condition for black, right? Because we know the win condition of black is the uh, thunder height. True, but the thing is also you know being able to uh, shut down the left lane means he's less likely to have access to cross lane plays. Yeah, the assassinate. Yes. No, as in not assassinate. As in uh, what <laughs> cross lane play does he have? Assassinate, right? <laughs> no, for for black. For like black, for has... black. Or nah, no, not, not, not nothing yeah, much. Actually. Nothing much yeah. True, but he true. has four Salem in his favor, so that's one way to play against it. Okay, so that that's uh, <laughs> that's some synergy with Thunder Height. <laughs> yeah, he can he can really ramp it out really fast if he has to draw, but, but not, unfortunately not he yet. he doesn't draw any of them. Not yet, not yet. We'll see. We'll see. Let's hope you know. He better he should he should pray for his Salem in his favors. So the current bot states favors it's it's quite even. Yeah, relatively even. Right Hanshin now. is taking the left, black is taking the middle, and the right is right is pretty much even. even. Yeah. Fighting instinct. Yeah. Black <laughs> has black has six prowler vanguards. Yes, he does. Because of yes, he does indeed. Two two farmers. Yeah, two farmers. I I'll say 
problem when gut is strong uh, when you have cards like arm of rebellion arm the rebellion and miss of mm -hmm. awareness yeah yeah so that so his, his deck does have synergies so yeah black's deck is uh pretty much a minion centric buffing deck as expected for red green but he has very little kill, kill, kill potential intimidation huh okay moves the kifi to the left lane i'm not too sure about this play i think it's a little bit too early yeah i think it's too early normally you want to save it for when you have like you know game winning plays yeah. especially when you can read uh, your opponent's deck you are you know what other cards to play around so you want to intimidate at the key turns but but yeah. uh, at the same time he doesn't have any play to develop uh, on that turn so i think that's fair i think that is fair so he can kill the enchantress this turn no accident no accident yeah no accident kills it uh yeah. Unless, unless, but unless, of course, he plays Prowler to uh, defend. Yeah, then that, that will be not enough. Yeah, that will, that will be enough. That won't be enough. So if he knows no accidents, I think uh, Black will probably just play Prowler Vanguard just to save the Ant Huntress. Yeah. So. But we'll see. We'll see what he does. I think no accident is a little risky, knowing yeah, that risky. the opponent has has six just Prowlers Vanguard. Exactly. Because <laughs> you, you, and plus, you, you're not guaranteeing a kill. So yeah. generally, I I prefer keeping no, uh, all these damage thing, dealing cards for guaranteed kills because there's always a counterplay. Okay, there we go. I see. Forcing Black's hand. Prowler Vanguard, there we go. And it's safe. Yeah. So, I think for Hind Chain, it's probably to play the Fighting Instinct. You want to get this card out as soon as possible. <laughs> if not, it's just going to stick in your hand forever. Exactly. Fighting, fighting Instincts, right? The earlier you play, the... the just get rid of it, you know, just get rid of that <laughs> bad card. Yeah, so yeah. mana inefficient. Five, Five mana, mana for like, one attack, one armor. That's exactly really bad. so bad. Hey, so, so, so the thing is, right, Kifi is basically just a bad, it's just a bad axe. <laughs> it's it has axe. good stats, it has decent stats. Decent stats, yeah, sure. Yeah, but his, his stat is strictly worse than uh, 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 axe. Yeah, but you don't and draft axe. You can drop, you can't draft three axe. True, true. <laughs> Unlikely. Okay, yeah. You can. You can. If you, can. If, if, you know, orange Jesus favors you. It just means you didn't pray enough. <laughs> or oh, he can drop the fighting instinct. Uh, yeah, yeah. Just get rid of it. Yeah. And shoot. And, shoot and the headshot creep. the uh, call of the wild, probably. Uh, okay. I, I don't want to creep. Yeah, that keeps your sniper alive. Yep. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, never mind. Now. <laughs> <laughs> but it's okay because uh, Black is using up all his cards, so he's he's running low on cards compared so, to Henshin. So the next turn is uh Henshin power turns. So yes. what what I would do is chain frost. It's probably you probably don't even chain frost. You can't even kill the Mazzy. So yeah, I think assassinate would probably be the better play. I said somebody, and for me, I'll, I'll consume, sacrifice one of the heroes. The creeps. A draw, hero, like To draw two cards. Probably Mazzy. I mean, uh, yeah, Mazzy. Probably assassin the Mazzy. Either that or mid lane. Or you can uh, play Spring the Trap. Now we have drawn it. Yeah. You have trap is, is... Spring mid lane? Yeah, the last lane. Spring the last lane. Oh, yeah. I would think, I would think right. Because mid lane is a bit hard to defend. Unless he wants to defend mid. I think last lane is better. No. Yeah, because mid lane. Chain Frost doesn't kill Mazzy. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, I, guess <laughs> it, I guess it clears the board. Well, he clears the board, so it, it's fine, I think. Yeah, and fine. he's still pushing 25 damage. So. Yeah. But it has retaliate, so everything just takes 2 damage. So, yeah. so now I'll, I'll, I would eat probably... I... Debbie, Debbie? I will eat Debbie just to move Debbie somewhere else. Oh, no, now, he's now you out. now see him, him TP out. You prop you you have to eat what your your heroes. Yes, you should eat. I oh? think the eating uh, is fine as well. Eating is fine. Okay. You you preserve the damage. Yep. So, for Hanjin, yeah, you spring the trap to the right. Yep. Spring trap right. 
Yeah, I think that's probably the best line of play. Yeah, so... The others is pointless. The boss state. Ooh. Uh, not too sure about this. Verdant Refugee. Refuge? Refuge? Refuge. Yeah, Refuge. Not Refuge. <laughs> refuge. <laughs> refuge. <laughs> They're all refugees. <laughs> it's probably best played on the right lane. Yes. Right lane, yeah. yeah. The left, the mid lane is a, a dead, pretty much a dead lane already, I think. Yeah, you, you're already ahead, so I, I think doing this is pointless. So... Hmm. Huh. I would not, I would, why would I disagree with that? I think you play okay. Spring Trap. So based on well, what we can see on the board, uh, and we can see both players' cards, uh, if you Spring the Trap right, and you assassinate from left lane to right lane to shut down the Farron, uh, which shuts down the Thunder Hide for the next turn, which means yeah, you exactly. pretty much win the right lane. Yeah. Then this, this, this what I was thinking of, you know, uh, assassinate, like instead of change frost, I was thinking you should have assassinate right. Yep. To, 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 he still can uh, do it this turn. It's not. It's not. Too yeah, he still can. He's again true, true. He can. Uh, oh. Yeah. So he should probably assassinate right and then spring trap right. So he's yeah. thinking to. <laughs> I'm not too sure about the mid lane. Yeah, not too sure about it. I think he should put right. Let put it mid. I mean, these deployments uh, means he's most likely to assassinate the Beastmaster and spring the trap. But what's he, what's he going to do from lane 1? You assassinate. I mean, yeah, true, true. But why Tinker mid though? Tinker? Sniper, you mean? Sorry, sniper. Yeah. yeah. My bad. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's trying to defend. Oh. Uh, okay. He wants to defend. He wants to defend the mid lane. So for black, you just raw here, right? Yeah. Or I see. Or you just I think uh, you don't have raw, so you just drop the pack. Just drop the pack. And start hmm. punching through. Okay. That's an interesting line of play. Yeah, tipping out is correct. Uh, but not too sure about the rate. Maybe yeah, the red, exactly. Maybe black. Because now you both have black as stuck on the left. So for black, you just... Thunder height in front of... Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. That is fair. You... But I'll probably drop the thunder height. Yeah. Yeah. Right. You should. Uh, looks like he wants to put more pressure on the... Bottling. But he has the uh, three Thunder Heights, I think, in his deck. Yeah, yeah. three Thunder Heights. Yeah, there's one more in his hand right now, actually. So he, ha he can easily just play the other one. So it looks like is the Tides has turned. Now yep. black, black is the favorite one. Black looks favorite now. Although you have Gang and Assassinate in uh, Hanshin hand, mm. uh, which he can protect his second lane very well with his hero on the first lane. You can either Gang with Debbie or Assassinate. So what's a better player? You probably assassinate, right? I would assassinate. Assassinate would kill either one of them. Uh, Farman because or, because, or because the you might as well use up the seven mana uh, on this lane because you can't really do much. So I think you should you should the uh, beastmaster. Yeah, should beastmaster drop the oglody for more pressure. <laughs> yeah, like why not? <laughs> I mean, given that he's trying to push mid now, so he has switched from right to mid. But you might want to save the Oglody for uh, Chum Block for, for middle lane because it's quite scary. And yep, it's master. Okay. Gets assassinated. Okay. Gets rid of red in the mid lane. So yep. that's Must get out of red. That's good. Catapult. So do you eat here? Yeah, you eat here. Chain yep. Frost. Nice. So Chain Frost. He has, he has no black in the mid, so that's. Yeah. 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 But you look at Chain Frost right, and you look at all this armor. And he has one more word than refugee that he's going to play. <laughs> <laughs> Which essentially negates all the damage. Negates all the, yeah. the chain frost damage. So if he wouldn't refugees here, then uh, chain frost is essentially useless. You'll probably just drop the height, the pack here and you refuge from the right lane to the middle lane. Yeah. Unless of course he wants to go all in height right. <laughs> yeah, and for, wants to go 80. For black, you kind of want to wait for uh, Haichi to spend his mana first before you drop the pack. It's always yeah. scary that you drop, you spend all your mana, and then oh, your opponent has a counterplay. And then your opponent just slays it. 
Yeah, black like he doesn't have slay. Does he have slay? He doesn't have slay, and he has, had, he has no black hero. Oh yeah, he has no slay in his deck. You're right. You're right. You're right. Corpse torso. <laughs> Interesting. In uh, ambitious. But that's uh yeah that's that's that's, that's yes. not a lot of damage. Good, that's good damage. Good <laughs> yeah. damage. Yeah. Good damage. Good. <laughs> wow. You need to throw. Or your corpse torso. Op op. So you refugee. More damage. Wow. <laughs> refugee middle. Yep, refuge middle. Okay. Yep. So th that makes chain frost useless. Yep, pretty much in the mid lane. And makes all of black kilos refugee. Because yeah, <laughs> they're in a refuge. They are, they are not dying. <laughs> so yeah, I think black refuge. is favorite right now. Yeah, I think it's GG. Is there any way for him to OTK in the left lane right now? Uh, does he have I any? I don't think so. He has, he has no disciple of no, no the, Yeah. No but disciple, no. The old. Nope. Okay, but look at uh, this card Lodestone Demolition. And you look at the armor. Oh, the mid armor. Oh. <laughs> huh. But he has to draw it first. Yeah, he has to draw it first. Does he have nope. it? No. Nope. Lodestone would have been interesting, though. <laughs> so Lodestone, Lodestone is. Lethal. Lethal. Like, would have that? Would that have killed him? Uh, see, that's Lodestone. Uh, probably not. So you have three, nine, six. 18, 17. Nine. Oh, okay. So the arrow, arrow favors, favors Han Shen. He has one more turn to draw the low stone. <laughs> I think. Yep, yep. <laughs> I think that is is only out right. Low stone probably. Low stone and deal some. Just being able to do that 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 burst amount of damage. Yeah, low stone and do some damage here. Yeah. So there's twelve damage right now with low stone. Yeah. Unless he of course, you know, uh, Black plays a lot of Prowler Vanguards. Yeah, then he drops all three there. of his Prowler Vanguards. Yep, three in hand. <laughs> Chain Frost basically does nothing here. Chain Frost tickles. Yeah, it just, it just tickles. <laughs> tickly, tickly, tickly. So what can you do? What can Han Xin do? Nothing much. I don't know. Seems, <laughs> seems to be quite dire for Han Xin. He can gang one of the creeps and open up. Gang and gang and shoot one of the creep. So you gang, you, but gang, you gang the guy in front of Kisi. Uh, you you put Pocheng Nine and you gank. On the guy in front mm. of Sniper. And Tantras. And Tantras doesn't kill, right? Seven damage. With the knife, it's seven. Yeah, it doesn't kill. Two armor. Gang and no accident kill. Gang and fighting instinct. Oh, no accident, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he can gang and fighting things. But his bad hero. Oh, doesn't work. Yeah, it doesn't work. No, he has the uh, Kifi in the middle. So he can yeah, but uh, you, yeah. True, he can, he can, yeah, fighting his things. So actually, how do you pronounce Kif or Kif or Kifi? I don't know, I think it's Kifi. Is it double E's? Then it's Kif. E. Yeah, it's, it's double E. K E E F E. Yeah, so it's K -E -F -E. Kif. Kif. Is it really Keith? Keith? Because it's Keith. well, I guess Silent E, I guess. Yeah, Silent E. I don't know. <laughs> Sounds so like Keith to me. To play for the outs, <laughs> you you gang the creep in front of Keithy. You are uh, you basically assume that uh, Black doesn't have any blocker because he has four more mana. You you have to assume that you gang that opens up seven damage, puts him at twenty one. Put back at 21 and you pray that you draw a lot of stone demolition. 22, 22, <laughs> 22, 22. Oh, oh okay. he wants to kill the enchantress. He wants to gank the enchantress. Yeah, I think he's probably gonna do that. But assassinate, uh, sorry, assass uh, sniper dies. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm. why? You might want to save this for next turn, uh, but yeah, it keeps your black play plays alive. Fair enough. I guess he wants to save his black. So I think now for Han Xin, he has to draw no stone. No stone. <laughs> no stone or assassinate to keep alive. You have, you have to assassinate and gang the the the, oh, the, the, the creep swans are nice though. Yeah. Yep. The, Two good creep for him is good. The dinosaur. Yes. The thunder height to kill it because he has, he's dealing six each right now. 
Oh yeah, it's a speech. Arrows at arrows is nice. Tough luck. Tough luck. Lodestone? Lodestone? One no. more? Lodestone? No. Okay. <laughs> Bad life. So no Lodestone is no. Lodestone is what, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 19 damage. Close enough. Close enough. Nah. This this looks this looks kinda bad for uh Hienshin. Okay, what, what what can he do? No accident is useless because of old armor. Oh, yeah, yeah. arrows are good for arrow is good for Kenshin. Yeah now 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 we can look back like one turn ago where we can we can actually uh assassinate and gang the Thunder Height and lock the Thunder Height out for the play. That might be actually better. I'm uh, not too sure because that, that's the beauty of artifact, right? When you look at the game and you revise, and there's so many things that you can could have done differently that might actually win you the game. Okay, that's good. He locked the green out. Yeah. So. Which means that he's he's trying to lock out lock him out from uh, Thunder Height, but we know he doesn't have Thunder Height, but Kenshin doesn't know that. I think Kenshin with with, with his hand, he's no he know he he's already lost. Because he has no way of killing a Thunder Yeah, exactly. He still dies to the 6th siege though. Yeah, true. Yep. Yeah, he has to kill the Thunder Height somehow, but I think that's GG. There's nothing he can do right now. You want Lodestone Demolition. Sad, <laughs> sad to not see it in play. It's actually a very... Uh, it's an Enchantress counter. Enchantress is very popular in draft, so that that card might might not be that big. Okay, it's GG. Yeah, I think it's GG. Yeah, GG. there's no place that you can do here. Can you chain frost yourself? <laughs> <laughs> For the show. All right, GG. All right. Okay, let's go to the next. Let's look at another game. Okay, let's look at yeah the winners one. So. Han Cheng from the TIB community has fallen to black. Yes. Black has two wins now. Okay. Yep. So. Okay, so who else, who else left has one win? You uh, know what? Our, let's look at Namfi versus Khan Kick. Namfi is a very familiar name. It feels like. Why? It, I think he is a professional player. I think. You see? Wow. Yeah, but he yeah he has one one win. Let's go. Let's look at Nemfi and Nemfi Khan versus Khan Kick. I think Nemfi is, a, yeah, it's a very familiar name. He's running a uh, three color. Tri yeah, tri tri color. Tri color. Deck. A splash of blue Earthshaker. S splash Earthshaker. Yeah. Also, those on those on Twitch, sorry if we can't you know answer your chats. We are busy casting, but anyways, welcome all of you guys on Twitch or Facebook. Hope you guys stay enjoy the show and enjoy our casting. Any feedback, do let us know. We will look through the chats later. Okay, so... Okay, uh, so how, how's the game like right now? The current bot states favor... Khan Kick. Right, Khan Kick has taken the right lane. Yeah, but he has four heroes in... In the first lane. In the first lane. And then the yeah, thing yeah. is, uh, Nemfi is almost killing his left tower. And, and Khan Kick has two heroes dead. Tech Hunter and Earthshaker is stranded. Yep. So it looks like lights up. Lights up for Nemfi. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> lights up for Nemfi. What a uh, statement. But yeah, I guess so. Yeah, four heroes stuck on left lane. Yeah, yeah. And it's, it's, it's lethal unless uh, Nemfi does something. Okay, let's look at Nemfi's deck. You know, they, here. They, they call it the party lane. <laughs> <laughs> what? The, the, the English call it a party name. The Chinese call yeah, it, it the, the mahjong lane. <laughs> because you have four, four people playing mahjong in one lane. <laughs> Lol. Four, four heroes. He has one green hero, which means he can, he can block. What does all he can do? Uh, rose leaf and that's it. So yeah, rose leaf, that's all. Is there any legal but potential here? No, not really. No, I think Khan Kate doesn't do anything. He has he can't draw. Do so Prowler. Oh, there you go. Prowler. No, Prowler doesn't do anything either. Can he play two creeps? He can't play two creeps, right? So it. I think he should just play March. Yeah, play March. I think he should play March this lane just to keep the pressure up. Pressure, yeah. 
Although, wait, wait, can Khan kick defend his lane? Oh yeah, uh, no, it doesn't matter. No, you, yeah, you there's, no, there's no, there's no, there's no pressure on the other. other yeah, exactly. Side. It's, it's, it's fine. So I think you should put the uh, march on machines here. Uh, I think he should play the soul of spring on the Wyvern. It keeps the Wyvern alive. Well, let's do it for that now. Yeah, I think that's a mis <laughs> I think that's a misplay because Wyvern is essentially twelve damage. Exactly. For your next turn. Hmm. But he, he, he is getting a lot of gold though, so... Yeah, but you getting gold doesn't win you the game. <laughs> true, true. His... But Nemphi's uh, Elf Tracker is stuck, so his Echo Slams are useless. Yeah. So Tag it's a Ravage. <laughs> Tag Hunter is not. <laughs> Ravage. Solo Ravage. You know how that feels when you solo Ravage yeah. in Dota. And it's a creep. <laughs> it's a creep. <laughs> Lol. Value. Value. Indeed. And Echo Slam will creep in the middle lane. Okay, yeah, he's getting he wants he wants initiative, so I guess that's good. Saying that just for initiative. Yeah, but right now Nemphi can drop two 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 of the heroes. But no blue, so Echo Slam can't do it's essentially dead. Yeah, Echo Slam is dead. So he needs to be able to find a way to uh uh Earthshaker somehow. Nemphi is craving craving for the T P scroll. Blink dagger yes, or TP. Is. Yeah, blink dagger or TP. He can okay, drop a rose have? leaf. Oh, his blue doesn't seem to be that good either, actually. He's blue. He only has Echo Slam, lost in time, with one reserve, and that's it. The rest is just... Yeah, I, the blue is not very impactful, except the yeah. uh, Echo Slam. Splashing blue exactly. is always very risky, because... I, I don't know, I would disagree Splashing blue, because he doesn't have really, really good cards. Yeah. Worth Splashing blue for. The problem with Splashing Blue is uh, you, often you against better player and especially when they know your deck, it's very easy for them to dodge your blue heroes. So it's very hard for you to play the relevant spells on the relevant lanes. Exactly, exactly. So normally, you know, if you splash blue, you want really good cards and ideally maybe, you know, yeah. It's risky. Some way to move them some some way to move your blue hero around. So is it GG? You can you can play two creeps here. I think you draw first, right? you always draw first. Yeah, draw first so drew, and then... Oh uh, yeah, he drew a creep so it's fine. He can defend. Uh, he, can, he, he can actually play all three creeps to block. All three green creeps, sorry. You can also play the red creep. Yeah, but I, I would think that... I think it's better to just play the weaker ones because you can play more just in case. You know, uh, can't kick that something because you don't know what he does. Uh, you can always wait for him to do something and then you play. Uh, true, true. <laughs> Otherwise, it's yes. better to play a creep that sticks. Which Augur survives everything here. Yeah. But you never know. Okay, well, does, does Kung King have slay? Yes, Kung King has slay. But we don't know whether he's played it yet. The question is, is it lethal? Is it any lethal potential? He has steel strength. Steel strength is lethal. Yeah, yeah. yeah steel strength is lethal. He can steel strength the Tinker. From anybody. Yeah, but he can still block though. Uh, Nemphi can still block. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, he has uh, he has creeps to block. It's, it's, it can't be like I I don't know. I would have played much of the machines yeah. last turn. <laughs> I think you play much here. You set it. Yeah. You set up a two turn. Auto, yes. auto kill. I think I think just march. Yeah, you march. Can he winter's curse something to clear up board? Mm, uh. Winter curse kills nothing. No. Kills nothing. I don't think so. You can kill the uh, rebel decoy. Rebel, that's it. But <laughs> it's probably There's not no, worth it. no damage there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so game is not ended yet. Yes, he it does is. force. He forces huh. everything out. Interesting. He wants to keep ogre alive. For Danfi, is this is the worst spot ever for him? Because he, both of his stalled hero are on the right lane, uh, on the wrong lane. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you have tight and... On the high and... <laughs> oh, Shaker are both wrong lanes. Oof. Oof. Oof, indeed. No much? No much. Do you slam here? Do you echo slam here? I think you just do You it. have to slam here, yeah. <laughs> just push for extra 8 damage. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, there you go. Damage. And Condemn you just push that damage. Hammer. Hammer? Hammer the content? Oh! No! Okay. Okay. No? okay. Just, just lost a creep because of that. I guess exactly. uh, not hammering, it's 
it sets up your Earth Shaker to die. <laughs> Basically, he kills your Earth Shaker, so I, I think he wants I think he wants that. <laughs> Unless he gets a TP here. Okay, no TP. No, nope, no TP. Does he have Blink Dagger in his deck? Uh, one. One Blink Dagger. Yeah, he does. But he doesn't have enough gold. Yeah. Sadly. So I think this turn is probably GG for... Nempy. Unless he draws some outs. Is what? there anything he what can, can he draw? draw? He can primary draw the... Primary draw... Yeah, primary the deck. can help. Oh, that's too much armor. I think primary raw keeps you alive for one more turn. Yeah, yeah. If he draws his oh, primary raw. Draws it. There you go. And no more. <laughs> uh, arrow? 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 No arrow. He's I think it keeps, still keeps you alive. Yeah, he can roll sleep and then roar. I think you roar first. Uh, or you yeah. can roll sleep first. That's fine. You should probably roll roar first just in case. Roar the legion. Roll the legion, yeah. Lock him, lock him out of his uh, the duel. Yep, of red, yeah. Uh. So Nephi can play two creeps here. Yeah, he can also call the. Actually, wall. would it have been better to roar? I think winter roar would be better because win. Winter. Because winter can move. Yeah, I think you roar first so that winter can can't fly out. You open up two open space so that winter don't fly out. Oh, oh there you go. He okay. should have roared. Does he not? He roared. Does he not count the damage? from the bases. So what can you do? I Winter can fly left, uh, fly right. Fly anywhere. Yeah. Anywhere right or left. And Tinker can shoot the creep in front of Raven, the rose leaf creep. Ro rose leaf. Yeah. Yeah, that kills it. Should be GG. Okay. okay. That's also another way I guess. It's not <laughs> I think it's Winter. It's Winter man. Although I think he's probably waiting for. Uh, you want to fly uh, last, right? You, want, you always want to fly last. You want to fly last, yes. You want to fly last just to, to guarantee you, ha you have empty space and not blocked. There we go. Alright, so I guess this is GG. GG. Yep, this is GG for uh, Can't Kick. Nemphi can't do anything right now. Yeah, but... Okay. Click the button. Accept your defeat. <laughs> the there we go. <laughs> Accept your defeat. Accept your fate. Okay, it's GG. So can't take one. All right, let's see who else can we watch. We have. Let's let's. We have one more game left. One more, one game. more game left. Okay, so so that that will be a game that you watch, right? The yep. Alleria versus Edom. Okay. Oh, some a grill. Luck. <laughs> grill photo. I don't think it's real grill. It's probably a fake picture. <laughs> okay, so they're both one tower down each. Yeah, and game is. Not looking to end soon. A lot of heroes are dead. Something's wrong with my game client. It's uh, uh really slow. I think my game client is bugging out. You might want to restart the game. Restart it, yeah. Let me just re yeah spectate again. So what's what's the hand like? So hand freedom has a lot of his card locked because of the arrow glass. Yeah, yeah I think I'll, I'll, I'll restart my Steam client. Seems to be quite laggy, I don't know why. Yeah. Alira can push Leto in mid, I think. He does have a uh, horn, he has a yeah, uh, salt ladder. The horn of the alpha. Yeah. D -D. And it's thir 13 mana, he can play anything he wants in mid. GG horns. GG horn indeed. GG <laughs> horn. <laughs> he can play the rose leaf first and then horn. So Alira deck looks. Uh, Better because of the the hero quality is better. Uh, yeah. Freedom runs Storm Spirit. Not too sure about that hero. I think that hero is only decent when when it's run in the mono black because you can capitalize on the passive gives to mm -hmm. attack every time you cast a black card. Yeah. So horn is not GG right? Because horn the the alpha is blocked. Can't, can't use Rose Leaf here. And look at what? Freedom has forward charge. <laughs> 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 what a card. Gives your allies two siege. Siege. All of his allies. But the thing is, his board is a bit uh, small though. Yeah. Yeah, it's like three three units. I think he yeah. can't. Or he, he can't kill. Alira can't kill Freedom in this, this round. 
And next. He charges and the cannon. Alright. He can okay. uh he can get rid of of one creep. Cool. Oh it doesn't matter. The creep doesn't matter. He can sh so what what will you do? I think you I think you shoot both of the creep. You team cannon the right creep and keen for keen for turret the left creep. Yep. Yep. And then you, you throw the forward charge to, to pressure, try and force something out. And you hope. Okay. I think you I think you forward charge next turn, right? Where you have more yeah. heroes. Yeah, yeah because it's, it's pointless, it's only three units, so the forward charge is better for next turn. Because next turn three all three heroes come in. Uh next turn he can Thunder God as well. Yeah, but yeah, it's pointless. Yeah. A forward charge now. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah that it's okay. I yeah. will have keep it for next turn. Kill the melee creep? Yeah, kill the melee creeps. King for oh he didn't. See? He just uh, passed. He, he just passed. Maybe he forgot about the King Fork. Correct. So you fa you can face boot, right? If you don't King Fork. I think you King Fork now. If you don't King Fork, you, 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 you die. You have to King Fork. Yeah, yeah. Fork. He has to King Fork now. Yeah. He has to remember. Oh, oh no, oh. he didn't. Arrow? 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 Huh? Oh, it's straight. It's no, straight. no. Feed him feed yeah. just through a game. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, no. Feed him just through a game. Through a game. Fork. <laughs> These are the games that when you look back and you you like what am I doing? What is what? <laughs> Maybe he didn't notice it, you know, like like too much pressure. All right, guys, time for round three. <laughs>